Brought to you by wikivd.com Felipe VI of Spain Felipe VI is King of Spain. He ascended to the throne on 19 June 2014 following the abdication of his father King Juan Carlos I. He is the only son of Juan Carlos and his wife Sofia of Greece and Denmark. When Juan Carlos was chosen in 1969 to be Francisco Franco's successor Felipe became second in line to the Spanish throne. In 2004 Felipe married TV news journalist Letizia Ortiz, with whom he has two daughters. Leonor the Elder is his heir presumptive. In accordance with the Spanish constitution as monarch he is head of state and commander-in-chief of the Spanish armed forces and also plays a role in promoting relations with Hispanic America and the former Spanish East Indies which are collectively called the nations of its historical community. Birth and Early Life Felipe was born at Our Lady of Loreto Clinic in Madrid the third child, an only son of Infante Juan Carlos of Spain and Princess Sofia of Greece and Denmark. He was baptized on 8 February 1968 at the Palace of Zazuela by the Archbishop of Madrid, Casimiro Morcillo. His full baptismal name Felipe Juan Pablo Alfonso de Tadus Los Santos consists of the names of the first Bourbon king of Spain, his grandfathers, his great-grandfather King Alfonso XIII of Spain, and de Tadus Los Santos as is customary among the Bourbons. His godparents were his paternal grandfather Juan and his paternal great-grandmother, Queen Victoria Eugenie of Spain. Shortly after his birth he was styled Infante. Although his father was not yet king, the ruling dictator Generalissimo Francisco Franco died just over two months before Felipe's eighth birthday and Felipe's father ascended the throne. In his first official appearance, Felipe attended his father's proclamation as king on the 22nd of November 1975. In 1977, Felipe was formally created Prince of Asturias. In May, nine-year-old Felipe was made an honorary soldier of the 1st King's Immemorial Infantry Regiment. The occasion was marked on 28 May and was attended by the King, the Prime Minister, and several other ministers in a ceremony at the infantry's barracks. On 1 November the same year, he was ceremoniously paid homage as Prince of Asturias in Covadonga. In 1981 Felipe received the collar of the Order of the Golden Fleece from his father the chief and sovereign of the order. On his 18th birthday on 30 January 1986 Felipe swore allegiance to the constitution and to the king in the Spanish parliament as required by the constitution, fully accepting his role as successor to the crown. Education and military training Felipe attended school at Santa Maria de los Rosales which his daughters currently attend. Felipe attended high school at Lakefield College School in Ontario, Canada and studied at the Autonomous University of Madrid where he graduated with a degree in law. He also completed several courses in economics. He completed his academic studies obtaining a Master of Science in Foreign Service degree from the Edmund A. Walsh School of Foreign Service at Georgetown University where he was the roommate of his cousin, Crown Prince Pavlos of Greece. As the heir to the throne a carefully regulated and structured plan was laid out for Felipe's military training. In August 1985, a royal decree named Felipe as officer at the General Military Academy in Zaragoza. He began his military training there in September. He completed the first phase of his formation in October. In July 1986 he was promoted to cadet second lieutenant. He was also named as midshipman. On September 1986, 
He began his naval training at the Escuela Naval Militar in Pontevedra joining the 3rd Brigade. In January 1987 he continued his naval training on board the training ship Juan Sebastián Elcano. In July he was named a student ensign at the Academia General del Air in Murcia. In September 1987 he began his Air Force training there where he learned to fly aircraft. In 1989, he was promoted to lieutenant in the Army Ensign in the Navy and lieutenant in the Air Force. In 1992 he was promoted to captain in the Air Force. In 1993 he was promoted to lieutenant in the Navy and captain in the Infantry of the Army. Further promotions in 2000 were Commandant in the Army Corvette Captain in the Navy and Commandant in the Air Force. Promotions in 2009 were Lieutenant Colonel in the Army, Frigate Captain in the Navy and Lieutenant Colonel in the Air Force. Since June 19, 2014, after his ascension to the throne, he acquired the rank of Capitan General of all the Spanish armies activities in Spain and abroad. Felipe undertook his constitutional duties assiduously as heir to the throne, hosting many official events in Spain and participating in all events of different sectors and aspects of Spanish public life as required. Since October 1995, Felipe has represented Spain on a series of official visits to the Spanish autonomous communities starting with Valencia during which he made contact with Spaniards from all walks of life. Felipe has held regular meetings with constitutional bodies and state institutions keeping up to date with their activities. He also attends meetings of the various bodies of the central administration and of the autonomous communities as required by his national and international constitutional obligations. Felipe has welcomed as many public and private audiences as possible to maintain Crown interaction in national and international affairs. In particular he has held meetings with people of his generation who have built successful careers in political, economic, cultural and media circles. As part of his military training Felipe trained as a military helicopter pilot. On occasions when King Juan Carlos was unable to attend Felipe presided over the annual presentation of dispatches to officers and non-commissioned officers in the armed forces as well as participating in military exercises held by the three armed services. Felipe has made many official visits to Europe and Latin America as well as to countries in the Arab world, the Far East and Australia maintaining a special interest in all matters relating to the European Union, Latin America, the Middle East and North Africa. Since January 1996 Felipe has represented the Spanish state at many Latin American presidents' inauguration ceremonies. As prince, he visited every country in Latin America except Cuba and made over 200 foreign trips in total. Felipe has also played a very active role in promoting Spain's economic, commercial and cultural interests and the Spanish language abroad. He frequently represents Spain at world economic and trade events, and is especially interested in promoting the creation of centers and university chairs to advance the study of Spain both historically and in the present day at major foreign universities. Following the 11th of March 2004 Madrid bombings Felipe along with his sisters Elena and Cristina took part in a public demonstration. Felipe speaks Spanish, Catalan, French, English and some Greek. Social activities In addition to his official activities, Felipe serves as honorary president of several associations and foundations such as the Codespa Foundation which finances economic and social development in Ibero-America and other countries and the Spanish branch of the Association of European Journalists. 
comprising outstanding communications professionals. Most noteworthy is the Principida Asturias Foundation where he presides annually at the International Award Ceremony of the highly prestigious Prince of Asturias Awards bearing his name. Felipe was appointed a UN eminent person by UN Secretary General Kofi Annan in 2001 during its International Year of Volunteers and continues to make contributions internationally towards enhancing the importance of voluntary work, sports and participation in the Olympics. Felipe was a member of the Spanish Olympic sailing team at the Barcelona Games in 1992. Felipe took part in the opening ceremony as the Spanish team's flag bearer. The Spanish crew finished in sixth place in the Soling class and obtained an Olympic diploma. Felipe has been a supporter of Atletico Madrid since watching them win the 1976 Copa del Generalísimo final. Felipe himself in height has attended Spanish European and Olympic basketball championships. Both his mother and uncle, King Constantinos II of the Hellenes were on the Greek sailing team at the 1960 Summer Olympics in Rome and Felipe's father and sister were also Olympic sailors for Spain. Reign On 2 June 2014 King Juan Carlos announced his intent to abdicate in Felipe's favor, as required by the Constitution of Spain. The Spanish cabinet began deliberations the following day on an organic law to give effect to the abdication. The law had to be passed by a majority of all members of the Congress of Deputies, the lower house of the Cortes Generales. According to Jesus Posada, the president of the Congress of Deputies, Felipe could have been proclaimed king as early as the 18th of June. On the 4th of June, El País of Madrid reported that Felipe would indeed be proclaimed king on 18 June. Felipe ascended the throne at the stroke of midnight on 19 June. His father had given his sanction to the organic law affecting his abdication just hours earlier. The next morning after receiving the Captain General's sash from his father, he was formally sworn in and proclaimed king in a low-key ceremony held in the Cortes. He swore to uphold the constitution before formally being proclaimed king by Posada. Upon his accession, he became the youngest monarch in Europe being nine months younger than King Willem Alexander of the Netherlands. As king, Felipe has fairly extensive reserve powers on paper. He is the guardian of the constitution and is responsible for ensuring it is obeyed. While he is nominally chief executive, it was expected that he would follow his father's practice of taking a mostly ceremonial and representative role acting largely on the advice of the government. He indicated as much in a speech to the Cortes on the day of his enthronement, saying that he would be a loyal head of state who is ready to listen and understand warn and advise as well as to defend the public interest at all times. A poll conducted by El País, however, indicates that a majority of Spaniards wish Felipe would play a greater role in politics, with 75% of the 600 people surveyed stating they would approve if he personally pushed the political parties to reach agreements on national problems. According to an El Mundo newspaper poll, Felipe had a greater approval than his father prior to his reign. In June 2014 Felipe and Letizia became the first Spanish monarch and consort to receive and recognize LGBT organizations at the palace. Felipe also changed the protocol in order to allow people to take the oath of office without a crucifix or Bible. In their first overseas trip as monarchs Felipe VI and Queen Letizia met Pope Francis in the Apostolic Palace on 30 June 2014. They subsequently met with Cardinal Secretary of State Pietro Parolin accompanied by MGSR Antoine Camilleri, Under Secretary for Relations with States, 
The visit followed one by King Wang Carlos I and Queen Sophia on 28 April. On 18 July, the new king chaired his first meeting of the Council of Ministers. In February 2015, Felipe announced he would cut his annual salary by 20% as a result of the economic recession and hardships continuing to hamper Spain. The elections in 2015 resulted in no party winning enough seats to form a government. No agreements with the different parties were successful. After months of talks with the different party leaders and with there being no apparent candidate in a position of support in forming a government, a royal decree was issued dissolving parliament with new elections being called in June. This marked the first time since the transition to democracy that an election was called under Article 99.5 of the Constitution, wherein the initiative for issuing the dissolution of the Cortes belonged to the King and not to the Prime Minister. On 3 October 2017 as huge protest rallies and a general strike took place in Catalonia following the 2017 Catalan independence referendum. Him the king delivered an unusually strongly worded televised address in which he condemned the actions of the referendum organizers for acting outside the law accusing them of unacceptable disloyalty and of eroding the harmony and coexistence within Catalan society itself. He also warned the referendum could put the economy of the entire northeast region of Spain at risk. Reactions to the king's speech were mixed. Party officials from the PP and Ciudadanos acclaimed the king's commitment to legality whereas leaders from Unidos Dodimos and Catalonia and Comú criticized it as unworthy as irresponsible paving the way for a harsh intervention of the Catalan autonomy. As for the PSOE its leaders showed their support to the king's words in public but were unofficially upset that the king had not made any call to understanding a dialogue between both the Spanish and Catalan governments. Marriage and issue Felipe's bachelor years were a source of interest to the Spanish press for several years. His name was linked with several eligible women. But only two notable girlfriends, Spanish noblewoman Isabel Sartorius around 1989-1991, daughter of Vicente Sartorius y Cabeza de Vaca who was viewed unfavorably by the royal family due to her mother's cocaine addiction and Norwegian model Eva Sanum who modeled underwear. When Felipe finally began a serious relationship, Nothing was suspected before the official announcement of the prince's engagement on 1 November 2003 to Letizia Ortiz Roccasolano, an award-winning television journalist formerly with CNN who had been married previously. The couple were married on the morning of of May 2004 in the Almudena Cathedral, Madrid with representatives of royal families from all over the world and most heads of state from Latin America present. Felipe and Letizia have two daughters, Leonor Princess of Asturias, born on 31 October 2005 and Infanta Sofia born on 29 April 2007. Titles and Styles Though Juan Carlos held no official title or post in Spain prior to 1969, his son Felipe was registered in the civil registry as an infante when he was born, with the style of Royal Highness. About a year later, General Franco recognized Juan Carlos as the future successor to the headship of state, and bestowed upon him the title of Prince of Spain. Thus, Felipe became second in line in the line of succession to the vacant throne. Juan Carlos became king in 1975 but no title was conferred on Felipe as heir apparent until 1977. When he was created Prince of Asturias the traditional title normally held by the heir to the Spanish throne, the royal decree granting him this title also entitled him to use 
The other historical titles corresponding to the heir of the crown, Felipe started using the Aragonese Catalan title of Prince of Girona publicly on 21 April 1990, during a trip around Aragon, Catalonia and Valencia becoming the first Bourbon to use this title. Later he did the same thing with the Princedom of Viana in Navarre, and the titles of Duke of Montblanc, Count of Cervera, and Lord of Balaga in the respective places. Upon ascending the throne, Felipe assumed the same titles held by his father. If the former kingdoms of Aragon and Navarre had separate naming styles he would also be known as Felipe V of Aragon and Felipe VII of Navarre along with Felipe VI of Castile. Arms as heir to the Spanish throne Felipe's coat of arms were the Spanish arms differenced with a label of three points azure. The first quarter represents Castile, the second Leon, the third Aragon and the fourth Navarre. Below are the arms of Granada. In the center, on an inner scutcheon is the ancestral arms of the sovereign house of Bourbon Anjou. Surrounding the shield is the collar of the Order of the Golden Fleece and surmounting it was the heraldic crown of the heir to the throne decorated with four half-arches. Following his accession to the throne the label on his arms was removed, and the crown of the heir was changed to that of the monarchs. This arms differ from that of his fathers as king as they do not feature the cross of Burgundy or the yoke and sheaf of five arrows. Brought to you by wikivd.com Would you like to